Hey, what is going on and welcome to this training where I'm going to show you the three-step formula for 10xing your income and your productivity. And I don't use 10x lightly. I know 10x is a really sexy number that people throw around, but I'm going to walk you through the exact formula that, man, by, by the time you're watching this, probably over 300 guys have gone through our program, have gone through our system and use this exact same three-step formula to literally 10x their results, to 10x the money they're bringing home every month. Not just revenue, but like money going in their pocket that they can then diversify and invest and, and go have new experiences. And at the end of this training, I'll, I'll walk you through a couple examples just so you know we're not just making shit up. This stuff works. And like I said, I've seen men come into our program at Wake Up Wealthy all over the place, scattered with barely a business, and they leave with with a business that is predictably producing 40K of personal income every every month. Um, one of our clients, Steve, I'm gonna walk you through how he used this exact system. But what I'm about to show you, it's all based in science. I'm not only going to show you what to do in this training, I'm going to show you why it works because studies show that when we actually understand why something works and we understand the method behind the madness, our unconscious mind buys into it more so that we can implement it more. So make the decision now. This is either going to be another free training that you watch that you don't really do much with, or this could be the exact free training, the exact information that you've been waiting for to help unlock new levels of productivity, to unlock new levels of production within your business, within your day, within your life, so that you can achieve the results that you want predictably and, and in an exciting, fulfilling way. So, I mean, dude, let's just dive right in. Here's the three-step formula to 10X your income, to 10 up, 10X your productivity in a real predictable way. So step one is an optimized morning routine. If you're watching this video, you're probably no stranger to the importance of a morning routine. But not a lot of people talk about the science behind a morning routine and why it works. Because when you wake up, your mind is like clay. It is very moldable. And so what we do in those first moments of waking up, what we do in our morning shapes our brain and how our brain is gonna work throughout the day. So if we wake up and we just roll right into the day, we're checking emails, we're checking texts, we're checking social media, we're putting out fires, we're solving other people's problems, and we don't actually set our GPS, we don't actually set our intentions, we don't take care of our own software, our, our brain and our body. If we don't optimize ourselves in the morning, we are on the roller coaster. When we don't optimize ourselves in the morning, our neurochemistry sucks, our brain is all over the place, our body, our strength, Stress levels, our hormones are all over the place, and we lose productivity, we lose power, we lose focus, we lose energy. So optimizing your morning routine is the quickest and most effective way to put more fuel in the tank, to get clearer and get more consistency. So at Wake Up Wealthy, we do the MBSB morning routine, the mind, body, spirit, business morning routine. And here's part of it that we have all of our guys walk through. The first thing we have guys do is a cold shower. It could be 30 seconds, it could be 10 minutes if you're a real psycho, but a cold shower, because a cold shower in the morning, it stills the mind, it, it balances your nervous system, right? It balances your nervous system, and you overcome resistance first thing in the morning, just like Navy SEALs making their bed. By overcoming that little voice in your head first thing in the morning by taking a cold shower, not only are you energetically awake and your mind is focused on what's happening, you're in the present moment, because let's be honest, when you're in a cold shower, you're not thinking about anything except the present moment, the cold shower. You have to catch your breath. You have to regain control of your mind and your body. Doing that first thing in the morning balances your nervous system so that you are present instead of worrying about what's coming later in the day, which is what most people do. And that's why they're not as successful. They're playing the worry game all morning. And that leads into the rest of the day. Meditation. Now, meditation is kind of like exercise at this point. Thousands of peer-reviewed studies have confirmed the benefits, the mental benefits, the emotional benefits, the physical benefits, the energetic benefits of meditation, the transformative power of meditation. So developing a meditation practice is crucial. It is crucial for you unlocking your potential, making more money, and becoming more productive. On our website at wakeupwealthy.com, we have tons of free meditations. You can find a ton of them on, on YouTube. Um, but having a meditation practice, and start where you are. You don't have to go from not meditating at all to meditate, trying to meditate two hours a day. Like Start with five minutes a day or 10 minutes a day. Start with guided meditations. But doing that, especially after a cold shower, will give you control. It will put you in the throne. It will put you in the driver's seat of your life, of your mind of that day. It will help synchronize your mind. We have different compartments in our mind. And when we meditate, we synchronize our mind. It's like, 
It, it would be like having a football team, every player on the field running different plays. That would not be effective. That would be chaos, right? So meditation, especially after a cold shower, synchronizes the parts of your brain so that all the players on the field are, are, are running the same place. You can focus more. You can execute more. You can be more productive and be more positive throughout your day. Cold shower, meditation, reading. Reading 10 pages or listening to 10 minutes of Audible of something enriching and something empowering, learning something new, activates your mental agility. It activates neuroplasticity, which is your brain's ability to adapt and rewire itself. So reading something new, 10 pages of something new every single day um, will help sharpen you, will help develop you, will help turn your mind, make it more resilient and make it more agile so you can be more proactive throughout the day and you're just building new skills. You're making your, your skill set more valuable by reading new things every day. Gratitude journaling. Another thing that studies have shown has, has improves mental health, physical health, emotional health, your immune health. Gratitude journaling, writing three to five things that you're grateful for. That's it. it. takes like a minute, a minute and a half. But when you do this, think of your brain, try to flex your bicep and your tricep at the same time. You can't, right? It's one or the other. Your brain is the same way. Your brain can either focus on what is positive or your brain can focus on what is negative. Your brain can focus on what is working or your brain can focus on what is not working. It cannot focus on both at the same time. So when you gratitude journal, you are tilting your mind in the positive direction. You are setting a positive GPS for the day. And when you do this day after day after day after day, your mind just becomes more positive by default because human beings, our brains kind of have a negative default setting. That's just how our brains work. It's uh, It helped keep us alive when we were cavemen to constantly be looking for what's wrong, to constantly be looking for the next threat, right? That's, that's what kept our caveman ancestors alive. But constantly worrying about every negative thing going wrong doesn't work today, now, when you're trying to create a new life, when you're trying to achieve new milestones in your business, in your income, in your productivity, and the impact you have on this world. So consistently doing gratitude journaling is retraining your brain to focus on what is working, to focus on what is going well. That will make you more positive. It'll, it'll make your brain more powerful because it won't always feel threatened. That's very important. And then last but not least, time block your day. You don't have to, you don't have to plan it down to the minute, but with you'll find the right amount of structure for you. But time blocking your day is so important because you're making your time yours. When we don't time block our day, we just let our schedule, we just leave our schedule opened to, to the chaos of life. We put ourselves in a reactive position because now other people can take our time. Other things can pop up. We can find ourselves easily distracted. But when we time block our day, it's like putting bumpers on a bowling alley. We, we, we give ourselves direction. We give ourselves structure that we can work with it. So time blocking your day. What are your top three tasks for that day? Great. Time block them. Give, like what, what, what time is going to be invested in those tasks? When you do that, you give, again, it's like setting the GPS of your unconscious mind. You start to have focus. You start to have direction. So now your unconscious mind, your conscious mind, your thoughts, your beliefs, your actions are all pointed in the same direction. When you can do this every day, you will have far more productivity. And you'll have far less stress, far less anxiety. You'll have way more clarity, way more focus, way more resilience. You'll be, you'll be excited about what you're doing. And here's the catch. Do all of this stimulus-free. Meaning no texts, no social media, no news, no score updates, no emails. Do your morning routine without any stimulus. I get it. You, you may use your phone or your computer or whatever for meditation or reading. Um, and that's fine. But like no stimulus. Nothing alert, nothing jumping up and taking your attention. Everything becomes your, your intention, right? When you can optimize your morning routine like that day after day after day, it will just, it will change you as an action taker. It will empower you as a leader. It will, it will truly allow you to really get in that flow state where you're clear, where you're focused, where you're dangerous. That's what a morning routine will do for you. And it compounds. The more you do it, the more effective it is. The more you do it, the more your brain changes and you transform. The more you do it, the more you embody a more powerful version of yourself. So an optimized morning routine is powerful. And you can play around with the order. You don't have to do it in the order we have it here. But these are the key ingredients that will jumpstart what it is you're doing. And yeah, you may have to wake up a little earlier to get all this done, but the ROI you're getting on your time, if you decide to do this, the ROI you're getting on your time will far exceed the time you give up to do this, right? It'd be like if you put a dollar into a machine and you got $100 back, you would do that all day because the ROI is so tremendous. So yeah, you may have to wake up 30 to 40 to an hour maybe, to 60 minutes early to do all this, but you'll see that what you get in return in terms of energy, focus, and productivity far exceeds what that hour of sleep would have done for you. So an optimized morning routine is crucial. 
Next, step two, accountability in the law of averages. Accountability in the law of averages. If you are not using this to your advantage, you are using it against yourself. And here's what I mean. So um, a study, I think it was done a few years ago, they studied maybe like tens of thousands of people were in this study. It was the Department of, of the Department of Labor and Development, I think. And they did a study um, about the effects of daily accountability, of daily accountability, checking in with someone. And they found that those who checked in daily increased their success by 93%. They were 93% more successful than the control group who did not have any accountability in their life. Meaning every day, checking in with someone who is holding you accountable to a higher level of standard, to a higher level of action, to the goals that you have set, makes you 93% more successful. What would your income look like right now if you were 93% more successful in what you did every single day? If you hit 93% more of your goals, if you hit 93% more of your commitments, what would your bank account look like today if you've been doing that for years and years and years? So accountability at a scientific level, at a neuroscientific level, changes your brain to be more accountable, which means you are more uh, I guess you could say more committed to yourself. You are more resilient. You are more consistent and that builds momentum. And here's the best part. Execution creates clarity and momentum. Taking action creates clarity and momentum. Everybody wants more clarity. Everybody wants more clarity. Where does clarity come from? It doesn't come from waiting around and, and waiting till, till everything feels perfect. It comes from taking action and seeing what works and seeing what doesn't work. That's it. And so accountability, joining a group, joining a, 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 I mean, like, like wake up wealthy, joining a group of like-minded people that hold you accountable. Like your ROI is going to be insane, dude. It's going to be so fucking insane because the more action you're taking, not only are you going to know more, you're going to know what more of what works and what doesn't work, but you're going to have momentum. You're going to have, you're going to have wind in your sails instead of like going, trying to swim up river. So accountability is probably the, the highest ROI thing that most guys just leave on the table, right? So you are leaving a lot of money, a lot of production on the table by not by not joining or investing in a group or a coach or someone that will actually hold you accountable. Sometimes our friends and our family, they have the best intentions, but they're just not ruthless. They're not, they're not gonna hold us to an elite standard. A coach will. At Wake Up Wealthy, we hold all of our guys to a standard. And if we don't, if they don't check in, we come, we come after them. We say, dude, where are you? Right? So we call them out. But that's what leads them to being massively successful. That's why when guys join our program, they five, six, 10x their personal income because of the accountability. Now, what is the law of averages? I'm sure you've heard that um, you know, you're the sum total of the five people you hang out with most. And I used to roll my eyes when I heard that because I was like, nah, like, no, my, my choices decide how successful I am, not who I hang around. But the more that I know about neuroscience, the more that that is actually true. We have these things called mirror neurons and they're always working. So your mirror neurons are working right now, whether you knew it or not. When you're hanging out with your friends, your mirror neurons are working. When you're at Thanksgiving with your family, your mirror neurons are working. When you're sitting in traffic, your mirror neurons are working. They're constantly taking in the behaviors of people around us and at a subconscious level, absorbing them and mimicking them in some way, shape, or form. So we mimic other people's thoughts. We mimic other people's ambitions. We absorb and we mimic other people's reactions and energy levels and commitment levels. So literally, by surrounding yourself with high achieving people, by surrounding yourself with a tribe of people who think in a higher way and act in a higher way and have higher standards and, and they take care of their body in a, in a higher way and they, they treat their business in a higher way and they normalize high standards, just through your subconscious mirror neurons, you will begin to do that too without any extra work. It will just, it will just seem like it's happening out of nowhere, but that's the power of your subconscious mirror neurons. Now, obviously this works both ways. So if you have a network, if you have a surrounding or an environment of people who aren't very ambitious, you're gonna, it's like going to be trying to swim upstream. You're going to have to work harder to maintain ambition because your mirror neurons will be soaking in their thoughts and their standards and their energy and their goals. So when you can actually utilize and leverage the law of averages, it's like, again, it's like having a motorboat versus trying to paddle upstream. You do this, it's the biggest favor you could do yourself is surrounding yourself with like-minded people who are pushing forward and holding themselves to a high standard. When you surround yourself with people who are making more money, guess what? 
you will normalize that and you will unconsciously put yourself in positions to make more money. It's, it's incredible. We see this every single day with new guys joining Wake Up Wealthy. That's the power of group coaching is the law of averages. Your mirror neurons do the, do the work for you. You don't have to you know, try, try, try. Like It just becomes your new normal. And before long, you find yourself breaking records, making more money than you ever thought you were allowed to. That's when stuff gets really awesome. So accountability and the law of averages. That is the second ingredient in this three-step formula that will skyrocket your productivity and 10x your income. And I'm just like, you can, it can far exceed 10x. You can 100x your income. But I'm just using that as a number based on what we normally experience here with the guys we coach. So step one, optimize morning routine. Step two, accountability and the law of averages. Now, step three, you need to immerse yourself in a positive feedback loop. If you look at every single high performer, you look at every single elite athlete, you look at any, like if you've ever learned a, you know, if you ever played a sport or if you ever, you know, played an instrument or even like learning to drive or whatever, you are in a positive feedback loop. Positive feedback loops accelerate learning and transformation by up to 350%, right? So if you are growing a business, if you're a new entrepreneur or even a seasoned entrepreneur or business owner, how like how much money would that translate to if you could accelerate your learning and your growth 350 if you could go 3 and 3.5 times faster every single day, right? Like you would get done in a year what most people get done in 4 years, right? And so this is the positive feedback loop, right? You take you take information in a strategy, right? You take information in a strategy. And you can get this from a book. You can get this from a podcast, right? You learn something new and you execute it until completion. Meaning you take that plan and you execute it until you have achieved that plan, until you have maximized that plan. And then once things are done, once you have the dust has settled, you review the outcome results. You review the outcome results objectively, right? And then you get strategic feedback. What worked, what went well, what didn't go well. And based on that strategic feedback, you optimize your strategy and you try again. You're constantly testing and iterating. This is how business accelerates. This is how the iPhone 1 went from the iPhone 1 to the iPhone 12, right? You start with you start with a strategy. You start with something new. And you execute on it. And you see it all the way through to the finish line. And then once it's on the finish line, you objectively review the outcome. You don't get attached to it. You don't define yourself by it. You objectively go, okay, cool. This is this is the result. Strategic feedback. Having someone go, this is what went well. This is this is what didn't go well. Do more of this and less of this. And if you look at people who move quickly, the people who go from zero to six figures in less than six months, boom, they start with something. They ruthlessly take action on it until completion. They review the outcome objectively. They don't get they don't get emotionally attached. They go, okay, this went well, this didn't go well. They're not, I'm not a failure. They're not they're not they're not basing their value off of the uh, results. They're viewing them very objectively. And then they get strategic feedback from themselves, from their from their mastermind, from their mentors, from from their business partners. And then boom, you optimize. You add, you tweak, you take things away and then you do it again. And where this is where a lot of people drag their feet is they consume new information, right? Like like this this video for example. Right? They consume new strategies and new information, but they don't execute till completion, most likely because they lack accountability. Right, But like that's where most people fall off. They never actually implement until completion, which means they can't review their results objectively, which means they can't actually optimize. They don't have any strategy. They have nothing to provide the feedback on because they never executed until completion. So putting yourself in a position where you're getting new information that has been battle tested and proven, you have a support system so you're executing until you complete it. You have the tools and systems to objectively gamify your results and then you have feedback coaching and consulting to strategically use that feedback to optimize. That will drastically accelerate your growth, your financial growth, your business growth, your personal growth, your spiritual growth, your physical growth, like all of it. So positive feedback loops. That is the quickest way to learn, right? Like right now I'm learning ukulele. I've never played the ukulele before. Guess what? I pay some dude to watch me play the ukulele so that when I mess up, boom. I'll learn something new. I'll play the song to completion. At the end, he'll we'll go over what chords I messed up, what transitions were hard. He'll give me strategic feedback because he's an expert. And then boom, I'll I'll utilize the new thing. And then it just it it, it speeds up the process. Whereas if I was just to try to figure it out by myself or try to do it with YouTube videos but not have any live feedback, I um I it would just take forever. Same thing. I'm learning how to box right now as well. Uh, I'm paying for a one-on-one coach because I, I need the feedback. I could watch YouTube videos and hit a 
uh, hit a, a heavy bag, but that my it's just going to take so much longer to evolve and grow, and I want results fast, as I'm sure you do too. And so this formula, optimized morning routine, accountability, and leveraging the law of averages, and then putting yourself in a positive feedback loop where you're getting attention, you're getting feedback, you're getting consulting, you're getting new strategies, you're getting accountability. It, 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 it speeds up results so quickly so you can actually 10x your productivity, 10x your income, right? And the reason I want to use Steve as an example, so Steve is a client at Wake Up Wealthy. And the reason I use him is because like he is that guy where we're like, dude, if it works for him, it'll work for anybody. And he knows we say that. He doesn't take offense to it. But like when he joined, he was all over the place. His nickname was The Disaster because in college, in high school, he was just always all over the place. Um, and so when he joined, he was barely making 4K a month as a loan officer. He had no morning routine. He had no consistent lead gen for his business because he just – he wasn't consistent. So if he's not consistent, how could his lead gen be consistent if at that point he was running his own business, right? And so there's Steve right there. And at the three-month mark, this is one of his check-ins from our Slack channel within the community. You know, he has 5 x his income, so he was making around 20 k a month in personal income, not revenue, in income. He scaled his business to the point where he has more clients than he can handle, so he's scaling, he's hiring, he's delegating. He locked in his morning routine. He reversed his mindset, so negative thoughts don't mess with him anymore. He's hired two people, and he's turned the table on prospecting, so literally people are seeking him out. Clients are seeking him out, right, because of how he established himself in the high standards that he uses. You know, and this is him at the six month mark. And so this check is really, really cool because he had a 32K month in income and half the month he was in the mountains hunting. The guy loves to fish and hunt and, and do deep sea diving, right? He was for 15 days. He didn't, he wasn't on his phone. He wasn't on his email and his business ran on autopilot. It still created 32K in income, right? Like it, it's just amazing that six months before that, he was the disaster making less than 4K a month. And today, and there's a, one of his, there's a case study of Steve um, on our website, and you can see a video testimonial. He is officially 10X his income. He's making 40K a month. He has his morning routine still locked in. He has teams, he has systems, he has SOPs within his business. His business runs on autopilot so that he can take half the month off and still make you know 30 to 40K a month in income. So this formula works, it works for anyone. You know, it doesn't matter what business you're in. It doesn't matter what industry you're in. It doesn't matter if, you know, you're in sales or you're a business owner, you're an entrepreneur. This works, man. We've seen it hundreds and hundreds of times. Optimize your morning routine. Use this exact thing that I told you, and it'll be amazing, right? Like I said, we have some additional meditations on the website at wakeupwealthy.com and the resources, right? Accountability and the law of averages. Like, join a group. Join a group. Join Wake Up Wealthy. Like we will hold you accountable to an insanely high standard and you will benefit immensely for it, right? The law of averages, surround yourself with guys who your mirror neurons will, 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 you'll want them to mirror, right? People that are doing seven figures, seven and a half, eight figures, right? Like that's what you'll get within Wake Up Wealthy. And, and, you know, and if you don't want to join Wake Up, Wake Up Wealthy, don't, but you owe it to yourself to join a group that will actually hold you accountable. And it's a group of high achievers who are like-minded, right? You owe it to yourself. You're leaving 93% more success on the table. Do the law of averages. Don't let it work against you. Let it work for you. And then as quickly as you can, Immerse yourself in a positive feedback loop where you're getting tested and proven strategies and you're having accountability so you can execute it to the finish line. And then where you have systems and gamified protocols to help you review the outcomes. And then you get strategic feedback and consulting based on that feedback so you can do it again and iterate and optimize. Like, like I said, we do that at Wake Up Wealthy extremely well. We've helped over 300 guys scale to the six and seven figure level. So use these three steps. Use these three steps. And when you do, not only are you going to notice more productivity, more energy, more focus, you're going to get more done. When you get more done, you're going to be more fulfilled. When you're more fulfilled, you're, you're a nicer human to be around for your loved ones. And you'll be making way more money in a more predictable way. So use this training, use this three-step formula. And if you're watching this on the Wake Up Wealthy website, if you want to know more about our program, um, I'm sure there's plenty of ways to do that on this website. I don't know what the website looks like at this very moment, but I'm sure it's cool. And I'm sure there's really cool things to click to learn more. And you can book a call with our team to learn how you can use these systems for you in your life and your business for where you are in this exact moment. So hope you enjoyed this training. Use this three-step formula and you'll be noticing drastic results in your life and in your business if you choose to do that.